Yep, so here I am. So now you can see his start and his drafts, right? So we'll just say I oh, oh I must have a look at the import oh, my contact from my old thing. I start that, and then you'll see if I refresh the inbox, that's up there. Let's say I'm going to reply to Google with a message, and say the phone rings or something like that, and I just leave it. So what I can do is I'll just go back here. Do you want to? No, I don't. I'll just click save now, and I'll go back to my inbox, and you will see here how it has gone into the drafts. So that's cool. So it's a good home page, you know. Uh, I'll just show you the themes as well. There's some nice themes. And I like this one. It's a desk one. So it kind of makes it feel nicer, you know. And you have everything here along your, you have your documents, you have your chat, and that kind of thing. So you have your inbox. So I'll show you the canned messages. So say I'm going to be sending um, an email saying, Thank you for your payment. Please find a be attached link to download your ebook. Okay. So I can just go up here and say you can't response. Or is it save? Try save. Oh yeah, you can't response. So it will say uh, Thank you, email. Okay. So, what I can do now is I'll just go to my inbox again and I will go to compose and I'll just go down here and I'll go thank you, email. So, I can just insert that and then I can just send it to you, say, and give it a subject. And if I, I think the subject can go in as canned message as well. And then when you're ready, just send it. So that's a great little tool, and you'll find that you'll use that quite a lot, you know. One more thing I want to show you, very important. If you're on a laptop or anything like that, the offline. So you can enable offline mode, and this will just add uh, <coughs> your inbox onto your desktop. And even when you're offline and off the internet, you can you can access your email, you can even make emails and send emails, but obviously they won't go until you're back online. But um, you can do this with documents as well, so I suggest that you do it. It's very, very good too, you know. Um, so I'll just add it to my desktop. Okay. And now you can see that it's just synchronizing with the online email. That's it, guys. Play around with it and uh, get used to it. And I can nearly promise you it won't let you down. Chat again soon. Bye.